This is our custom GPT, G Mailbot 2, designed to read and send emails with user consent. The privacy policy, accessible via the drop down menu, explicitly states that GPT will handle user data, and we at Nethram India Innovation Center do not actively collect or store any data related to the user's emails. Users will be prompted for consent before the bot reads or sends emails through their account. Here's how Gmailbot 2 operates. When a user requests Gmailbot 2 to read or send an email for the first time, it will seek user consent. After the user selects their mail account and grants the necessary permissions, they are redirected back to the GPT. The GPT then performs the API call and displays the response data to the user. In the Google Cloud Console, we use the project Gmail Assistant. The authorized JavaScript origins and authorized redirect URIs for this project include only OpenAI URLs, ensuring that only GPT has access to user emails. To demonstrate the API call process in detail, we will present it in the GPT's Editor tab. The callback URL obtained from the Editor tab serves as the redirect URL for the Gmail Assistant project. In the authentication method on the Editor tab, we input the client ID and client secret, and then specify the authorization URL, token URL, and scopes. With this information, GPT authenticates with the Google API. We have created a privacy policy and provided its link in the editor tab. This policy is displayed in the drop-down of the Gmail Bot 2 starting window. Now, we will show an example of reading an email from the editor tab to provide more detailed information on the API call. Since the user has already given consent, GPT will not request it now. Here, we can view the details of the API call made by GPT and the responses received. We have disabled the GPT additional setting that says, use conversation data in your GPT to improve our models to protect user data. Finally, we will present another example demonstrating how users can send an email using Mailbot 2. When the user prompts the Gmail bot 2 to send a mail, the bot will ask the user to provide with necessary information such as to address, subject and body of the mail. The bot will then ask confirmation from the user showing the complete mail and sends the mail after user confirmation. Thank you.